Hi, today I'm going to tell you all about um, the new products coming out in October and a little bit of, of my takeaways from um, this year's doTERRA convention. Uh, my name is Terry Foster and I am a certified essential oil specialist and certified melt instructor. And so I give um, essential oil education on this channel weekly. Hit the subscribe button if um, you would like to be notified whenever a new training is uploaded and um, feel free to comment below if you have any questions. Um, I can be found on all of the social media channels at, um, at I am Bionic Woman um, or the website is IamBionicWoman.com and I look forward to hearing from you. <laughs> Hello. Okay, so while we're waiting, we got one, one minute. Um, the doTERRA, the convention kit, we purchased it and um, <laughs> I purchased it and somebody ran in their underwear to get it from the UPS guy. They kept scared of Yeah. I was like, did you? Did you just do that? So how did you feel when you saw the doTERRA box? What happens to you? I was very excited because I knew there was some good stuff in there. Yeah? Some new stuff. Yeah. New stuff? New stuff. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, it's 11 o'clock, so I'm just going to get started. Um, I'm trying to be yes, yappy and get, you know, to the point. So. You? Um. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Okay. So I watched the convention online. Um, I didn't go this year and there's a few things that they kind of went over in the beginning that I really liked. So, um, I just wanted to highlight some of those things and then, um, I'm going to show you all the new stuff. Um, here, can you see, can, I mean, it's gorgeous. Okay. So they talked a lot about their focus. Um, fair, safe, and stable jobs in areas around the world that um, experience extreme hardship. And so that's part of their mission is to um, change lives and, and change lives everywhere, right? So out of 400,000 individual oils produced around the world, half are women. So they talked a lot about the co-impact sourcing and how they got started with co-impact sourcing. Um, because of the, um, the way the essential oil industry is designed is that the farmer um, gets the short end of the stick a lot of the times. And so they wanted to change that. So not only did they want to change it for the farmer, but they also wanted to to um hey liz i'm glad you're here oh you're gonna love this stuff um not only did they want to change it for the farmers but they they wanted to change the essential oil industry and the oils that they um produced so that's where co-impact sourcing um came into play so now i'll just give you some um uh, just a few statistics because i think it's kind of cool hey karen you can't hear anything. The um, the co-impact sourcing model was that they wanted to change the essential oil industry and they wanted to change lives. Um, and farmers were very much taken advantage of. And so uh, that's how co-impact sourcing um, got started. And um, if you want to learn more, I can put videos up in here. So just let me know because um, that's, I love the stories. Um, and so I'll just highlight a couple of stories so that, um, just to give you an idea. So out of 400,000 individuals producing oils around the world, half are women. Over half. Over half, yeah. And I mean, we're talking about mother in Kenya who is able to farm um, crop and produce oils um, in partnership with Oterra, get a fair wage, her kids can go to school for the first time. I mean, so 
that was the goal with changing people's lives. Um, actually, there's a mother in Kenya that grows the geranium. So if you like geranium, um, in Haiti, um, they found, um, so they, they, when they first started out, they sampled over a thousand essential oils and none of them were pure. And so when they finally started finding oils that were pure is when doTERRA started. Okay. Um, the oils are sourced in over 47 countries. And, um, so in Haiti, when they, um, discovered this vetiver that we now have, um, they went and they had to, um, drive, I think it was five hours to a village where they were growing the, this vetiver and discovered that this, um, area had no water. They had to walk to get to the water and then they still had to boil it when they got back. And so um, in Haiti, they have um, drilled four water wells. And so this area has um, fresh water now. And actually, that's where the earthquake hit in that area this last time. And so they were able to, because they're there, they're, they were able to check on the people. Created 18,000 jobs. 18,000 jobs. Thank you. Yes. Oh, I love it that you're helping me. Isn't that awesome? Okay. So. That's kind of the backstory. Um, if you've ever watched the video, I love that video of the pink pepper and the woman climbing in the tree. Um, i have show that in here um, and how her life has been changed. So, so that's um, just some of the stories that they tell, which are, are really, um, really cool. So then Dr. Hill comes on and you know, I love uh, my science. So I geek out when he starts talking. Um, essential oils, he does. <laughs> essential oils. Here's the point he wanted to make. Essential oils do two things. Okay. They aren't a cure. They don't, um, you can't out oil, bad nutrition, la, 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 right? Here's what they do, 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 do. You said do, do. I said do, do. <laughs> they support healthy cell expression. Okay. They help your cells, which is the building blocks of our bodies, interact and respond properly. They help the cells identify what the correct DNA should be, okay? They also offer cell protection and stimulate healthy function. So that's um, what we can expect from essential oils. So if we want to get, <laughs> turn your phone off. <laughs> If we want to get the best results from essential oils, using them consistently to support our body is where the magic happens. Okay. Magic. Um, there are no other oils like doTERRA. And so back to that co-impact sourcing model, um, they're on a mission to change the <clears throat> essential oil industry to, to, to separate themselves from a, um, an industry that is unregulated and full of fraud and deceit. And, um, so, <laughs> I don't know why. Um, okay. So I love all of the doctors that they have on staff that came on and gave presentations. Um, that to me is very exciting because, um, they're not just making, you know, these claims, they're actually doing a lot of research and there's actually been some published, um, research, which is really exciting. And I will post that another time because I'm already like, I'm already talking so much. Um, their commitment to sustainability, um, they have revamped a lot of stuff and there's a lot more in the works. So as you're going to see today, when I show you the products, um, they're, They've changed their model, um, their focus on sustainability, um, eco-friendly, earth-friendly, all that stuff, okay? Um, and they're, they're just getting started. They said that they haven't done enough, they could do better, and that they're committed to doing better. So that's um, awesome. 
So like in Hawaii, the sandalwood, for every tree that they harvest, they're committed to planting 120. So just, there's a lot of things that they're doing, but um, I like that. That? Love, love the sandalwood. You do, huh? Mm -hmm. There's a new manufacturing facility in Cork, Ireland. Um, I think we need to go visit it. Let's Maybe. do it. Yeah, yeah, let's do it. So that you may have noticed that the shipping boxes have changed, and that's all for sustainability reasons. <clears throat> they want everything to be recyclable, no more plastic. They took out those bubble wrap thingies. Um, the boxes, they're using 40% less cardboard. Um, they're using recycled material and the printing is actually soy ink so um, that everything can be um, recycled, com composted, all that good stuff, right? Um, okay, and then they don't have a recycling program. So if you have a lot of empty bottles, they actually, because of the carbon footprint that it would take for us to ship bottles, empty bottles to their facility, have them recycle them, would just add to the problem. So they encourage you to recycle locally, okay? Um, okay, let's get started. So those are just some highlights that I wanted to cover. So there's, there, so let's start out with the temporary products. Now, here's the thing. When they do convention, they make this, you know, big thing. They, they introduce the new products and they introduce the convention kit and then we race to buy it until it sells out, which it did. I think, I think that was the fastest they'd sold out of convention kits. Um, and what they do is they throw in a few bonuses. So when I'm going to show you the bonuses, but I actually don't know what the supply is going to be. October the 1st, they'll, they will release the, the um, products in the convention kit, but the temporary products is only going to be what's available. So, um, so let's do the temporary stuff, stuff first. I got Invisalign in. <laughs> I thought you needed a drink of water. <laughs> Let's do the temporary stuff first. Here, you do. You, come on, open it. Tell them about it. Okay, so they came out with a body oil. It doesn't have coconut oil in it. Matt's checking it out. It's a mix of passion fruit, jojoba, bobab, merengue, tocopherol, and sunflower seed. What do you think? I like it. <laughs> Let's try it. Just a little bit, I want to get old. Smells very neutral. Okay, so this is something you can use in place of coconut oil. Um, and then the sensitive skin, I am the one that's really excited about this. You're not getting your hands on my sensitive skin no, oil. I don't have sensitive skin. Okay, because this is the one I'm going to use on face. It has grape seed rose hip seed hemp seed to co to coferol. is that like a form of vitamin c to, to i'm not sure i think so and sunflower seed this is the one i'm going to use with my yarrow palm on my face i'm going to make a face serum and hide it you better hide it good i will you could add a couple little bits of my uh my yarrow palm right oh do you have your own bottle of yarrow palm uh, yes i do i use it every day Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So there's that. Those two items, I they were temporary <laughs> bonus in the convention kit. So I don't know what the deal. It says limited time offer. So I believe they're going to release them on October the first. Um, but they won't be a permanent product. Oh, available in October for a limited time. I just have to read my notes. Okay. I got lots of notes, you That's guys. That's why you call it temporary. That's why you call. Imagine that. Okay, Huga. 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 It's a cozy blend. Oh, Karen made a comment. <gasps> Her pores clog with the coconut oil. Yes, so that would be I know. We, we can't have that, Karen. So we I'm just going to tell clogging. you, if it's something you're really interested in, they, um, hi, Sarah. Oh, our daughter's Sarah's watching on. in the other room because oh, she has my. a story to tell you. Oh, my. Um, uh, what am I saying? Oh, the the oh, the pro limited products. Um, when they're gone, they're gone. So um, they're they're not permanent products yet. Um, I know when they are able to bring back permanent products, they do. But 
those the oils are not so i know i'm stocking up girl okay so, so boogie is warm woody amber and citrusy this one is the cozy blend here you where's it from again uh scandinavian oh, cozy nice. feeling really nice. oh it just it's so yeah. different um diffuse during the holidays mm. add to dryer bottles make a linen spray homemade scrub roller bottle for nighttime this is a limited time blend and um it's very nice I, it's like one of my new favorites let me tell you what's in it wild orange cedarwood amorous frankincense myrrh cystus vetiver tonka bean and vanilla <coughs> Good for skin too. Great pro room spray mixed with water and, and witch hazel. What do you think of Huga? I love it. It's nice. Oh, I don't. There's something about it. It's very different. I feel like this oil gets me. Just like Balance did. Okay. It gets you. Huga. It's spelled H Y G G E. I know we need smell a vision. Huga. H Y G G E. But it's, it's Huga. That's how you say it. Huga. Huga, 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 Huga. I just sing that song in my head to remember how oh, to say it. Huga Shaga. Yeah. All right, we got Osmanthus Touch. Osmanthus is in deep blue. Um, this is only available in your convention kit. So, um, It's, it's floral, sweet, and fruity. Healthy skin, soothing and hydrating. Apply to wrist for a positive aromatic experience. Okay, I got my, my um, diffuser bracelet on. So when I add it to my wrist, I'm going to my diffuser bracelet so that I get the benefits. Um, okay, so off Osmanthus Touch, I don't think... Why are you on there? She was texting me again. Um... I don't think uh, it's going to be available. I actually don't. Because it says only available in the kit. <coughs> Sorry. That's why you got to grab this stuff when they announce it. All right. What's this one? Copaiba. Copaiba. Or, or as my sister calls it, Copaiba. That's how they call it in Brazil. Oh, do they? Yeah. Oh, okay. Touch. It's in a roller. It's diluted, guys. I Touch roller. Okay, so they talked about the benefits of, um, we, we've talked a lot about the benefits of copaiba, copaiba and its effect on the endocannabinoid system, CE1 and CB2. About, there's actually endocannabinoid receptors on our skin. And so this is great for skin, this roller. Um, I'm not gonna go into all this because, let's see. Copaiba helps achieve balance and homeostasis in the body. Um, topical. So the roller is great for a localized response. So what that means is if you're addressing something with your skin or <coughs> discomfort, okay? So the, the touch roller helps it in that local area. And then Copaiba actually um, accentuates the benefits of other oils so if you have an oil that you're using say you're using lavender you can actually use the copaiba touch over it and it will um increase the benefits of that lavender okay what's plus the benefits of copaiba sorry what's copaiba in is that in one of the it's in copaiba it's an oil but i thought it's not in deep blue we're getting there oh sorry am i getting ahead of myself see he's excited <laughs> It's powerfully, powerfully relaxing. So talking about the skin, so the wood oils are great for the structure, the underlying structure of the skin, which copaiba is a wood oil, it's a resin, comes from a tree in the Amazon. And flower oils help replenish the skin, okay? The outer structure, the appearance. So something to consider. All right, the next one, Oh, Copaiba is a permanent product. It's $23, and it's going to be available permanently, the touch. Thank goodness. Now we're on to the permanent products. I got, I did the temporary ones first. Almost there, Sarah. I've got one more oil to go. Um, Tulsi. 
holy basil. They introduced this as a temporary product at one point, and now it's back as a permanent product. <clears throat> it's an ad adaptogenic herb. He talked a lot about basil and how people lump basils all together. And there's actually more than 150 varieties of basil, but oh, only... That's nice. You like that? I like that we're opening, I'm opening the stuff for the first time. Right? It's pretty exciting. That's why I wouldn't let him open it when we, when we got it. It's warm, spicy, and balsamic. Ooh. There you, you go. You can smell that. I use it, I actually, when, where I put it is over my adrenals. They're, they're in your back area. Um, because I'm tired all the time. And so, Tulsi helps, um, again, with balance and homeostasis. I what this is. Oh, what is it? This is Madagascar vanilla. Okay. Sarah's going to tell you a story about vanilla. You can sit right here, sir. I put okay. vanilla and harvest spice in the diffuser last night, and she was here sitting here studying. And I just put it in, I didn't say anything. And then she told me the story. Come tell the people. Um, well, I like to call it she oil bombed me. <laughs> She snuck in and she set down the diffuser and she was ran doing out homework. Because I was frustrated with my homework. <laughs> um, but I was like doing my homework and then I just kind of like when I when I got like a whiff of the um, um, the diffuser, I it just made me like feel like I was a little kid running in to the living room after playing outside and the leaves and like the fireplace was going and we had our little Halloween decorations out and it made me feel a lot better. I was a lot less frustrated with my homework after that. But That's the story. So what did I put in the diffuser? Did you say it made it, you, it, made it feel like fall? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. I put harvest spice and vanilla in the diffuser. That's what I used. It's rich, warm, and sweet. And I, I literally only put a drop of each. And she had that, that whole reaction. It's so sweet. Pretty amazing, right? So this vanilla can actually be used internally, and topically, and aromatically. It can be used all three ways. It's an absolute. It's sourced in Madagascar, um, which that's a really cool story. The, it's one of the poorest countries in the world, Madagascar. And... I wrote it down somewhere. I think it was like 18,000. No, the, anyway, a lot of jobs that have been created. Um, so it's the number one requested oil. And this holiday season, we're actually going to get, this is a permanent product. It's coming out October the 1st. And we're going to, this is the one that people scream the most for. So if you want vanilla, I'm, I'm just saying, don't wait. Um, thank you, Sarah. Thank you, Sarah. Um, so you can diffuse it, roll it, and ingest it. Yep. Wow. You can put it to, in your drinks. The Mayans um, discovered vanilla. They made it, they added vanilla to cacao and made a warm drink. Can I put a drop in here? Of course. Or two? Or just one? Just one. It's very precious. <laughs> so when they just harvest like, vanilla, like when they grow vanilla... They have to, there's only a specific type of bee that can pollinate the vanilla um, flower so that it produces a vanilla bean. And they only have one day a year that that vanilla flower can be pollinated. And if they don't get it that one day, then it won't produce a vanilla bean for an entire year. That's good. So they have to hand, they hand pollinate the um, vanilla flowers in Madagascar um, and they have to do it in the morning so they have one day out of the year and when the flower opens they have to pollinate it so that it will produce a vanilla bean. Crazy right? Crazy. So um, it is actually CO2 distilled or uh, um, CO2 uh, it's an absolute it's not an oil it's an absolute. What does that mean again? Absolute? It's just a different um, way that they Produce it. Oh, distill it or whatever. Yeah. yeah. Um, and you can use it for cooking. You can use it for all the things. Talk about the, the skin benefits of vanilla. And you can add it to a scrub with vanilla and lavender. 
Um, apply it with rose and helichrysum in your face lotion at night. Um, I had this idea, you know those Yonana machines where you do the frozen banana and you make ice cream? So, um, I live and die for ice cream. She does. I just do. And I was thinking, oh my gosh, I could get that Yonana machine, do a frozen banana and add the, the uh, vanilla to it and not have any sugar. That'd be so good. Isn't that awesome? Okay. Um, and then you can use it for a perfume. It's great with the florals. So, um... You can layer like the florals on like rose or jasmine or magnolia and then do the vanilla and it, it will be sweet. And then if you did it by um, reverse vanilla first with the florals on top, you'll get a different scent. So experiment, see which one you like better. That's going to be available. $35. I was shocked at the price. I thought it was going to be so expensive when they talked about how it's harvested. $35. This is really exciting. On Guard chewable tablets. I'm actually going to let Matt open it and Ooh. taste it. And while he's opening them, um, easy turbo. <laughs> They're going to be $16 available October the 1st. And you get 45 tablets. Is it 45? Oh, 60. 60. In a package. 60 tablets. Um, so it's the On Guard in a chewable with vitamin C, vitamin D, zinc, and beta-glucan, which I was listening to a podcast, and beta-glucan comes mm. from mushrooms. Smell that. Thank God I don't have to eat. Ooh, oh, those, those smell good. Smell the cinnamon. Did you taste it? Not yet. All right, mm. come on. Oh, that's good. It's good? That's good. He's going to want his own bag. So we've been using the throat drops for like daily support. Um, so I'm excited about these. Mm. Everybody in the family, it's these are these, you know, our immune system. We want to support it daily. So just pop a you know thing in daily. Oh, that is so good. Um, I did a, an immune support class, so I won't go into the benefits of C D and Z. I literally just did a class on the benefits of um, adding that, those uh, supplements. So, super exciting. Um, okay, here we go. Dun, da, da, da. If I could sing, I would. Here. Tell them. <gasps> Tell them. I live by Deep Blue. There we go. Split over we scooted over for Sarah. Yeah. Um. This is Deep Blue Stick Plus Copaiba. And I do the, I rub this on my knee. Well, I haven't rubbed this one, but the Deep Blue. I wouldn't let him use anything no, yet. I'm so excited I get to use all Okay, now you get now. to use it. Rub it on your neck. Tell him. Oh, you got the stick, Matt? You oh, have the lid on there. Oh, hold on. How's that? <laughs> it's going down. So, oh, oh. have you ever used Deep Blue? Forgot it was on your hands and got a tingle when you tinkled. I yeah. Have, I have. Yeah. Most people have. Deep blue, baby, I love you. So where should I rub this? Right Wherever you need it. So you're going to roll it where you need it. And it's no hands-free, no mess. They were showing like basketball players that wanted to use deep blue. But if you get it on your hands, you can't go and hit the basketball. So this is a stick and it has copaiba in it, which is not only going to benefit, um, it increase the benefits of the deep blue oil that's in there, but copaiba itself is fabulous for um, pain. And I can say pain because it's an approved, I, I got my things on, I'm spinning everywhere. <laughs> it's an approved over the counter pain relief stick. It's so nice. I can feel it working all over. I know. Okay, so it's going to be twenty four fifty, and it's one point there you go. What that something for? ounces. Oh, you could rub. You could give me a little Can massage if you'd like. Okay, so <laughs> yes. So here's the thing: if you have pain, which I can say pain now, we can. This is a claim, a, an approved um, topical analgesic. 
this is really exciting because now um, for me, um, you know, I want to share the benefits of oils for pain. So this one's approved. Um, okay, so let me just tell you about it. This is in a um, recyclable material. Um, packaging post-consumer material. It's free of silicones, phenol, X, ethanol, PEGs, retinol palmitate. Um, I told you copaiba increases the permeability of the other oils. Yeah, you guys. Matt, I think can they you, can I you think feel it? I think they need you to sing again. Deep blue baby, I love you. I really do. Okay. Delivers temporary relief of minor aches and pains of muscles and joints associated with simple backache, arthritis, sprains, strains, and bruises. There you go. Deep blue in a stick. Is that not the Does most that exciting? Or is that just for packaging? I don't know. I think it was just for packaging. Gotcha. I smell the winter green. Yeah. Can you feel it on your neck? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So now there's a whole new line. There's a new brand new essential oil blend. It's called Abode. Abode. Um, Abode. The refreshing blend. It, it's a 10 essential oils are in this blend. And now they're not replacing on guard blend. This is um, a whole other line. So just so you know, you're gonna see some, some of the products duplicated in the Abode blend. And um, it's just for a more, uh, more specific reasons. And I'm gonna tell you why. So the Abode blend is for um, cleaning surfaces and the air. On guard, is for our body, immune system, immune support, right? We can take on guard internally. We can use it on our skin. Abode is strong. It's probably not one you're going to want to apply to your skin. It's not going to hurt you. But if you do, you want to use one drop of abode to 10 drops of a carrier oil. So um, it's not recommended for topical use, but it's not going to harm mm. you. And the dog is <laughs> having a dream. He wants to get into the He dream. wants some abode. And then when you diffuse it, if you have littles and pets, I'm going to recommend that you use less drops. So normally we do, you know, four to eight drops in the diffuser. Um, I'm only going to use a couple when I'm diffusing it. Um, and just watch my animals and see how they react because there are 10 powerful essential oils in here. Lime. It's very different. Litsy. Cassia, tea tree, arbor vitae, cilantro, lemon myrtle, lemon eucalyptus, eucalyptus kochi, lavender, not to be confused with lavender, which this one you can diffuse. You can make a, um, a room spray with witch hazel and water. Um, you can put it on a cotton ball and stick it in stinky shoes, right? So a lot of the things you use like purify or on guard for. But just remember that it's stronger. So um, we're not thinking like put it on the skin. We're thinking like cleaning air and surfaces. Okay. Um, okay. So then there's a whole abode line um, that I have sitting in front of me. And so as I talk about it, Matt's going to demo it for you because that's what he likes to do. So let me tell you how when they, they did... Um, they revamped a lot of their products um, and made them um, eco-friendly, plant-based cleaners for the home that are effective. Let's just start with the multi-purpose surface cleaner. They added Timol, which is time. And if you've um, been with me for a while, you know that I have added time to the On Guard Cleaner all along because of its cleaning benefits. Okay, so they're it, the Abode Cleaning Line plant-based cleaners for the home. The average American home has 60 toxic chemicals in their home, in their cleaners. Toxins that act as endocrine disruptors, which um, produce adverse reactions with our neurological health, reproductive health, and our immune system. 
So we got to get the toxins out of our homes. Science is just beginning to identify the risks of these chemicals. And our young are the most at risk. So it's important that we start um, switching these products out. Now everything is um, designed with sustainability in mind, which is really cool. The packaging, um, earth friendly, reusable, recyclable, and concentrated. So everything is um, with those concepts in mind, that's how they designed all the, the new material. And now what they're gonna start doing is also um, moving into um, other products that they already have and using the same model with recyclable, reusable, and concentrate. Okay, so you're gonna see things um, changing. The formulas are the same. They're just gonna be changing the, the packaging so that it's more earth friendly and all that, okay? Aluminum is endlessly recyclable. Isn't that cool? So the only thing about the aluminum is that you might get your bottle and it might have dings in it because it's aluminum and when it shifts, it's just, it, it's likely to get dinged. So if you see that, there's nothing wrong with the product. It's just a trade-off so that we can be more earth friendly. Uh, we're going to have dings in our recyclable bottles. Okay. So where they couldn't use aluminum or um, anything recite if it's not recyclable it's at least either been recycled or able to um, been recycled and then reused okay so now we have laundry pods these are going to be 1950 for a 45 count can i open it yes the pod is actually biodegradable and you use one pod per load Unless it's a heavy or large load, you can use two. Um, natural enzymes to help remove stains. Everything is completely plant-based that I'm going to show you right now. And it's all based on the Ooh, abode line. It smells good. Oh, God, it smells clean. Um, Bio-based salts to help with dirt. And then um, here's the cool thing. No gray water. And what that means is if you use chemicals to clean and they go down the drain, those chemicals react with other chemicals and create toxic sludge. And that's what we're contributing to the earth. So none of this produces that. That's gray water, so that's really cool. That's important. Um, and then the, everything is recyclable and you know, you just all you have is this little tiny container to throw away. <clears throat> Pretty cool, right? Okay, so that's the laundry soap, um, 1950 for 45 count. The dishwasher pods, $15 for 24 of them. Each pod is encapsulated in a biodegradable film, gray water safe. Um, packaged with post-consumer recycled materials, um, natural enzymes for plant-powered cleaning. What do you think? Clean. Okay. These are all permanent products. This is really exciting, isn't it? Because we get back 30% if we're doing loyalty rewards. Um, we get back 30% for buying products that we all use every day. Um, and we get our shipping back. So, and it's all clean, plant powered products. This is really exciting. 10. Yeah. That's a sample. Oh. The kit came with a sample. My bad. It's 45 tablets. Pods. Sorry, pods. It's $15 for 24. The laundry is 1950 for 45. Did you already tell them it was infused with doTERRA abode? Yeah, everything doTERRA. everything we're going over is infused with doTERRA abode. The, the new blend that has 10 essential oils in it because of its, um, because of their, <laughs> da, 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 like dish soap. Sounds like Star Wars. Oh. That's cool. Dish soap. What? <laughs> so the dish soap has added grapefruit to help cut through grease. 
so excited to try the dish soap. Um, again, it has the abode in there. Um, added grapefruit, recyclable, all those things, right? And, and then there is a container, this one. So it comes with, you can do the pour spout, it comes with that, um, and then they give you an additional pump, so you can choose where, where you want your dish soap to come out of, the pump, pump, it off. pump or the, I like the pump, because you got chicken on your hands, you don't want to have to grab the bottle and pour it, that's my thought. Um, okay, dish soap, oh, it's $12. And this Huge. Is, and this is concentrated also? No. Oh, this is it. Right? This is it. Gotcha. You just pour it in there. Nice. But look at that huge bottle. And I love twelve dollars. I love these aluminum containers. Right? It's gonna be hard for me to throw them away. It will be. I'll have to do it. I save everything. I know, Liz. I know. October the first. So on the first, they're gonna do the convention kit, and they usually will discount it and then add free stuff. Um, and then after that, you can also do individual products. You get to choose. Um, you know, you get to choose, but if you want the kit, you got to do it like first thing. It'll sell out. Okay. Hand lotion. They made it in post consumable packaging and you just fill the bottle. Pretty bottle. Aren't these? These are gorgeous. They're awesome. These are prettier in person than they look on camera. They're so much nicer. I was really surprised. They're fancy. Very fancy. So you have a hand lotion and you just buy the pouch. So no more of the plastic um, hand lotions. It's scented with citrus bloom. Free from par parabens, phthalates, phosphates, dyes, and synthetic fragrances. It's made with shea, shea oil, beetroot extract, Tasmanian pepper extract which helps soothe the skin. The hand wash. Wow, because I've been making my own. Um, and I didn't like buying the big things. I do with the Citrus Bloom because I love this, the scent. But I like to make my own because I don't, you know, I don't like to use all those bottles. And now they've done it in the concentrate, in the aluminum bottle. It actually fills them twice. Um, this is concentrate, right? Yeah. And it'll make two. I mean, that's like... So you just pour half? Half. Half in there. Yeah. So the hand wash, it actually shows you where to pour the concentrate up to and then where to pour the water up to. And then whether you're using this or the old style, oh. something about the pumps is you just don't want to go up to the pump and then in between when you refill, just rinse this through with hot water, okay? That's what that works for. Yeah. Oh, God, I the concentrate it. and then the, Let me see it. the water. Oh, that's sweet. And then the water. Nice. Yeah. Okay, so hand wash. Um, citrus bloom. Dilution is one part concentrate to three parts water. So you could even still use the um, previous containers, or if you already have one that you like using, you can still use it and dilute it using one, one to three. The hand wash is 1950. The hand lotion is 1850. And those are permanent products. That's what it is, okay. Yeah, Whoa, the that's, glass set. That's cheap. So for all four of these, they offered these with convention. I don't know if they're going to do a set again, or it might be a limited. They are going to sell them individually. Now, I got all four for $28, the glass, these containers. So that was a steal. They have accessories for the cleaning products that are gorgeous. It's these trays, and those are going to be available also that you can set your um, glassware on. There's a little dish with a thing in there for bu making bubbles using for with the soap really cute oh, they're very pretty and then microfiber cloths and there was one other thing wool dryer balls are going to be twelve dollars you're going to be able to buy wool dryer balls nice. which um the huga is great for um in the dryer adding to your wool that's a tongue you try it 
say it together. We'll, we'll do what? <laughs> wool dryer balls. Wool dryer balls. <laughs> <laughs> say it with a Visalign in. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what's the um, what's the microfiber towels? What is that all about? Oh, for cleaning with. Oh, okay. they're gonna they're not out yet. They're coming out October first. They sold them there at convention, but they didn't sell them with the kit. Okay, did we did we do it? I think we did it. All right. This is all very exciting. It's very. I can't wait to try all this. So ex what what's the first thing you're gonna try? What's like what are you most excited about? Well, like what besides the stick, the deep blue stick? What like what? Um. As a man, what gets what gets you excited on this table? I think these because on guard I take a on guard drop every day and I, and I take a tablet and I think that's really helped me stay uh, healthy. So this is what I'm most excited about. Just keep using your oils; they're good. That's good advice. 